Hello everybody, Chris here, and today I'm going to be playing Cities Skylines. And I'm going to be challenging myself by making a city prosper while using only one road. So let's go ahead and start a new game. We're going to go ahead and choose, I don't know, this one? Garden Rivers? Sure. And we're going to call the city name One Road County. So let's get right into it. All right, here we are, One Road County. We have 70K to build a prosperous city. So we're starting out with the basics, basically, where we can only make a single lane road. But uh, we're technically gonna make two roads because I do need a way to connect um, these two highways. So we're just gonna do that. It's technically not part of the challenge, it's just to make sure that the roads are connected. So after that, we are going to go ahead and build a single road, like so. I want to get close to this area here, like this. We'll... we'll we're gonna try, we need all the space we can get because I cannot connect roads. So maybe it would be helpful to do this, right? A little swingy road gives us extra space to like snake along. So we're gonna stop right here. Okay, next we are going to go ahead and zone out some residential spaces. So I'm thinking of putting residential here and then the area close to the water here is going to be industrial. That's my thought. So, let's go ahead and put some housing here, and then commercial there. I'm going to go ahead and unpause so that they can start building. We are going to need electricity, so I am going to get a coal power. I know it's environmentally unfriendly, but I do need it. So we're just going to go ahead and put it right, right here. And then we've got to put uh, water. Where is the water flowing? Okay, the water is flowing from right to left. So the sewage has got to go here. And the pumping station has got to go a little farther away. Okay, and houses are being built, so that's good. Let's make some more. Because demand for housing is important. And we can stop at the... Where it's too close. Maybe this tree right here will stop at this tree. So the houses are going to need electricity and water. So first, let's go ahead and connect these two. And then we're going to connect this through the back way. Try not to use all my money. I'll well, do that. There we go. And then pipes. Connect it to this. Perfect. And then we're just going to follow the road. Like so. Boom. Easy. Okay. Um, we are in the red right now. So let me go ahead and bring this down maybe to 90. 90 for now. On both uh, nighttime and daytime. I only have this set to um, daytime because I don't really like playing at night. So let's bring this like this and hopefully we save a few dollars. Let's go ahead and put in some industry. 
right here. Bam. So we will watch this place grow. People are moving in to One Road County. Just got to keep going. I might just put like the police station, the fire station right here in the middle. So that means... Oh, perfect. I, I just noticed that uh, we are in the green. Perfect. So our city is growing. Let's go ahead and continue expanding this road. So let's expand inward like this. Right? Oh, oh, there we go. This. Okay. And then these roads are never going to touch. <laughs> They're going to have to go all around. More residential. That's what they need. And then are we going? Oh, we have achieved a little hamlet. We can get loans. We can tax people now, which is great. We have garbage services, healthcare services, and education centers. Okay. So with the new stuff we got, we got a medical clinic. Okay. It'll satisfy this road, but it won't satisfy this road. So we might need to build multiple stations. So let's just go ahead and build this. And um, community school or elementary this one is is it more expensive so i'm just going to do elementary so i'll put the elementary school right here yeah no no would it be better somewhere else maybe in the middle middle let me see hold on okay this It's not bad. This is not bad. But I don't think we need the elementary school next to Smog. So let's move it uh, here. That's a little better. These people can't get to it, but you know, that's fine. So we're going to go ahead and put a... I guess we'll put a landfill right here for now. Or should it be a recycling plant? Let's do um, let's do the recycling plant just because it conserves some more space for us. There we go. So we do have taxes available. So let's raise taxes to 10 and 11 for industry because it's so pollutant. Hopefully they don't leave. Oh! We got uh, Worthy Village. We can uh, get a fire department and police department and other things. And policies, perfect. Okay, I'm going to pause because things are moving really fast. So, we got the hospital. We need... We need the fire department. Boom. Boom. And we need the uh, police station, which is how much? 12. Okay, that's that's fine. There we go. Let's check policy. Okay, so policy. Cut those showers times in half and guide citizens to be more sustainable water usage by installing water meters. Upkeep 5 cents. Upkeep 5 cents. I don't know if I want to do that right now. Just because it will take a hit on my my profits. So I think this is fine. We got to start making the next area of our one road city. So we're going to go this way. 
like so. Gonna hug real tight here. This doesn't overlap and we can, you know, save some space. Like so. Okay. And let's make sure that they have access to water. They do. Yeah. We skirted a little bit. But we're fine. So let's go ahead and put in the residential. So we're at 2,000. I think I can raise up the budget for electricity and water to 95. I'll keep everything else 100. Okay. How's the school doing? Is it crammed yet? It's almost crammed. All right. So... I just realized that we have a four-lane road. Would this affect anything? Because I'd like to upgrade the roads. Let's see. It would affect it a little bit, yes. Let's upgrade it so we can have more people on the road. And then we'll fix these areas. Okay, this space is occupied, so I can't do it there. But I can't I can't do it there either. Spotty four lane roads. <laughs> I I hate this in real life. Where two lanes become four lanes and then four lanes become two lanes. But we have to do this in this kind of city, unfortunately. Okay, let's keep moving this. Upgrade what we can. Make everything a little bigger. There we go. Not to worry, not to worry. We'll fill things in so you can build bigger and better buildings. For the betterment of one road city. And I usually don't make curved cities because I just usually like them to snap in place. So it's all boxes. So this is this is a more unique design than what I would usually make. New houses are going to come in and it's going to be fine. I know it's red in population right now, but more people will come in. No worries. We'll get it done. Things will turn around. Come on back. Come on back. We just we just needed to upgrade all the ro most of most of the roads. Come on. Come on back. No no need to worry. This is a, a one lane road city is a great idea. So four lanes might be the max cuz I know you can have more than four lanes. Basically the highway, a six lane road. Um, but, uh, I think, I think we're just going to stick with a four lane road. Okay. We are in the negative right now, but we're slowly digging ourselves out of it. So, so that's, that's good. I, th I think that's what's happening. Can we get more people to come? <laughs> All right. Our population is back up to positive and our weekly income is going back to positive as well. So hopefully we can turn things around. There we go. We got. We went. Oh, a sinkhole is about to happen. Where? Oh, I would have been so heartbroken if it was happening in the middle of my city. Oh gosh. Okay. Well, we're fine. We're fine. Oh my gosh! Look at how fast. Oh, it's because I'm on three speed. <laughs> That's why it's the houses are just popping up. Oh, and I'm at tiny town. Perfect. Park areas, plazas, new policies. Okay, that is good. Let me go. Oh, and I got some money for doing that. It's always great. 
gonna go ahead and keep extending this. Let's go ahead and get a loan of 60,000. Let's take that. Well, we can pay it off. We're doing we're doing good with our money. And I'm going to put another garbage garbage place here. I'll uh, put it um, a little closer actually. Right here. And then healthcare. Okay. We're gonna need to put fire station, police station, and medical. There. So I have another hub here. Okay. So let's go ahead and check the policies, because we got new ones. Smoking ban, school's out, parks and rec. Prefer parks, park maintenance boost. Eh, I don't, I don't know if I want those. Let me see. I could rezone things. Make it more efficient. Let's see. This residential. Self-sufficient buildings. The self-sufficient residential buildings recycle their waste and produce energy with solar panels and by other means. Consumes 30% less electricity, produces 30% less garbage, generates 30% less tax income. Interesting. Okay. Do I want that? Because I love money. But it does, you know... They don't use a lot of power, they don't use a lot of water. So you know what, let me go ahead and try this um, with the residential area here. We'll change it to self-sufficient. There we go. And we're just going to do this. This is just an experiment to see if we can save money for it. I know we're going to lose some taxes for it, but maybe I can raise taxes to 11. 11 for commercial and then 12 for industry. Hopefully they're not too mad about that. I am losing some population because they have to redesign the houses. So we've kicked people out, but we're making things for the better. We have 20,000. Let me go ahead and start snaking back this way. There we go. So I've made it this way because I can break the trend. The industry will stop here. Right? This chunk over here will just be industry. And then we're just going to expand it out sideways like so, like right here. So we're going to start putting industry just on a certain block so we can have some more housing. Uh, we need more commercial, it looks like. So we can actually put that. Let's go ahead and put some commercial here. I need to fix the water stuff. And then I'll go ahead and put some commercial here so that they have it. Okay, people are slow to move into the self-sufficient neighborhood. So I might may take a pause on, on that idea and just build some more normal residential areas. Okay, should I beautify the area? with some parks do we have small parks we have some small parks okay so let's put one let's put one here or here this might be better right here 
Perfect. Oh, and we got Boomtown. Perfect. We have new policies, new roads that we're probably not going to use, and we have new services and all that. Cool. Okay, there's a policy that I want to enact, and it's this one. Allowing recreational use of controlled substances attracts more tourists, but also requires more police presence in the area. Slightly increased tax income, increased tourism, slightly reduced crime rate, increases poli police budget by 15%. We're going to go ahead and get that. How about this one? Work with 20% efficiency. Ooh, I might want that too. Why are my firefighters not firefighting? There's a lot of buildings being burnt. And we don't have the helicopter, helicopter depot. Hmm. Oh, we have, we have a power outage? Why are we having a power outage? Hmm. Okay. Let's bring out the heavy machinery. Right here is a good spot for windmills. There we go, that should help out. Oh gosh, trash is piling up everywhere. Hmm. What is going on? What is happening? Okay, I might as well just get a landfill. Slope too steep. Put it right... Put it right here? Hopefully that will help out with the trash. Okay, I don't know how to solve this. If you know, please let me know in the comments below. But I think I'm going to pause right here. I can say we semi-completed this challenge of making a one-road city. I mean, it is possible. It's just that the, um, the time, the driving time, is really bad to get from one place or another and as you can see there's a lot of logistical problems going on garbage bo dead bodies piling up fire what is this what is what not n not enough educated workers so i would say i semi completed this challenge um but yeah, if you have any tips as to why this is happening other than the road being too long let me know in the comments below but I think I'm going to leave this one road challenge right here semi-completed. So why don't you try this challenge of making one road? Maybe you can do it better than me. If you did, let me know how you made it better. Because I'm stumped as to how to fix this garbage problem. <laughs> but either way, I'm going to leave things here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, hit that like button. Subscribe for more awesome content, and I'll see you in the next video. The Chris of Games, out.